Rachel Marie Oberlin, born October 7, 1986, known professionally as Brie Olson, is an American actress, model, and former pornographic actress. She performed in over 460 pornographic films from 2006 to 2011. Since leaving the adult film industry, she has become critical in the industry and the stigma attached to being a former porn actress. Olsen was born in Houston, Texas. Olsen's mother and stepfather moved with her to Fort Wayne, Indiana when she was two years old. Olsen entered the pornographic film industry in November 2006 and initially worked for a variety of companies such as Digital Playground, Elegant Angel, and Red Light District Video. She was a contract performer with Adam and Eve from 2007 to 2010. Olsen was named Penthouse Pet of the Month for March 2008. In 2010, she was named by Maxim as one of the 12 top female stars in porn. She appeared on the cover of the May 2011 issue of Penthouse, on the cover of the August 2011 issue of Playboy magazine, and on the cover of the July 2013 issue of Hustler magazine. She retired from shooting pornography in 2011 at the age of 25. Olsen has appeared on the E! network reality show Keeping Up with the Kardashians. She appeared in the independent comedy film Purgatory Comics which was released in 2009, co-starred in the horror film The Human Centipede 3 Final Sequence in 2015 and appeared in Penn Gillette and Adam Rifkin's director's cut in 2016. In 2015, she played Diva Talks in the short web film Power Rangers. She has also done a series of videos for Will Ferrell and Adam McKay's website Funny or Die. In February 2011, Olsen moved in with actor Charlie Sheen as one of the girlfriends whom he nicknamed his goddesses. Her relationship with Sheen ended in April 2011. In 2016, she described her post-porn social life in the Daily Dot, Porn didn't hurt me. The way society treats me for having done it does. This article was later followed by her March 25 appearance in the YouTube documentary series Real Women Real Stories in which she repeated these statements adding that she believes society in general perceives former porn stars in a highly negative manner, specifically as morally akin to pedophiles. She is critical of the pornography industry but not of the profession itself. We are the only entertainment industry that doesn't offer talent royalties after they are gone. On February 3, 2011, Olsen was arrested and charged with driving under the influence in her hometown of Fort Wayne, Indiana. She pleaded guilty to the charge and received a year of probation and was ordered to perform community service. That's all for now. Hope you enjoyed the video. Do hit the like button, share it with your friends and comment your valuable thoughts below.